Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 100 of Two Point Hospital. So we are still in Duckworth upon Bilge and that staff morale is still driving me insane. Um, I've been working on a few little bits um, in between episodes. Um, I've upgraded all of our bathrooms um, to golden toilets. Uh, so that's, I'm hoping, will improve things a little bit. Uh, who knows, I've made these training rooms uh, as good as they can be, so now they're level 5. Um, what else have we got? Um, I've set off an upgrade for a colorizer. I've hired another treatment nurse as well, because we seem to have a few missing. Um, and we do have another surgery now, and I have a tendency to put treatment nurses in there. Uh, so, yeah, we've got another one of those. I have noticed another diagnosis nurse. Will work for peanuts and is funny and dismissed by the Orb Foundation for cuboidal behaviour. Whatever that is. Uh, I think we're going to get them because we do have a lot of diagnosis rooms on the go. Um, and we Can we train them? No, we can't, but that's fine. Because uh, hey we've opened this now as well. Radio. This is Harrison Wolf. I'm excited to announce that next week I'll be talking to up-and-coming politician Tabitha Winsock about some of the great plans she has for the county's future. Here's some music from the time it is now. So we're going to try and get that staff morale up. I can't believe it's actually dropped down to 79% now just to really annoy me. Uh, we were at 82. Uh, so that is a bit baffling. Um, but we're going to just make sure that people are on breaks that need to be. Um, have you got much of a queue? Massively? Go for a break. You can go for a break as well. We've got, these are all our diagnosis ones that want a break. Of course they do. Have we got any staff that are really low that want training? They're on a break, they want a promotion. Let's check our pay. All good. 80%. Not great. Not great at all. <laughs> uh, attractiveness. What else could we do here to get a bit more attractiveness in the corridors? Let's just go for decorative. I have a charity dog. <laughs> not, I've not placed one of these before. Um, are these very attractive? Fairly. Okay. Um, what else have we got for attractiveness? Anything useful? Decorative item, dip in duck. A jukebox. Is that really attractive though? Lots of things that we haven't unlocked, of course. Fishing closures. Um, rugs? You can't put rugs outside, can you? Indoor fountains, large fountains, so much stuff that just, just wouldn't go, though, if I placed them. <laughs> wall plants. You can have a wall plant. Do they need watering? No. Oh, interesting. You can place them above your benches. Ooh. <laughs> I like these wall plants. Let's place a few more of these around, shall we? Have we got any other... Oh, wrong way. Other waiting areas that are a bit dull. Hmm. They're not great, though, are they? We've got all the big, big areas here um, that obviously aren't very attractive as well. So maybe we could just throw in a few cheesy gubbin statues. If we can find them. Golden gubbins. Just to make those areas a bit nicer. Can we do something to make this staff area a bit nicer here? A food pyramid poster. They're a bit rubbish though, aren't they? Give them a beach painting. 
Dog art? Mountains? Why not? Let's make it a little bit nicer. Oh, we've watered 10 plants. Awesome. We've got staff promotions. Maybe this will help um, if we promote some staff. And let's get training this assistant because they've been sat there for ages <laughs> really wanting training. Um, can we get any better ones? Hygienic marketer. Hygienic green fingers and positive. Quite like them. Let's get them training in custom service from that person there, I think. Cure two patients with uh, shock horror is our newest public target. If I can remember where that room is. There we go. <laughs> too many too many hospital wings now going on. <laughs> too many. Have we got any patients going there? We've got one waiting here. Oh, another public target. What have we got? Oh, trainer staff member, promoter staff member. Perfect. We've got that one. And we've got training ongoing. 85% <gasps> morale. Just 5% to go. Come cool. on, wouldn't it be perfect if we could uh, complete Duckworth upon Bilge on the 100th episode of Two Point Hospital? Uh, speaking of which, um, I'm going to be moving away from the long series of numbers um, and I'm going to individually increase the uh, individually number the episodes based on the hospital. So moving forward when we go to Grockle Bay I'll do one to however many it takes to complete the hospital and then when we go on to the next hospital we'll go back to one again and just give each hospital its own number series because it, it's just getting a bit ridiculous now. I'm up to 100 <laughs> and I just think, well, you know, I don't think I need to quite have uh, that many numbers in the series. Uh, I think it's, yeah, we'll just go for something a bit lower and I thought that might uh, work out quite well to do it that way. I'm trying to copy that and for some reason my brain's just gone absolute failed and I can't do it. So we're just going to get a radiator, place one over there. 87% morale. Oh, come on. Come on. We can do this. Can we cheat? Can we put, just give them all a <laughs> pay rise? <laughs> I mean, it's really important that your, your staff are happy. They're going for breaks when they need to. Uh, the training. Oh, speaking of which, those two want training, don't they, actually? Let's give them some maintenance training. <gasps> that one's a teacher. Oh, they could train them too. <laughs> okay, uh, let's do that first. And let's let those other two... Um, let's let those other two janitors go on a break, I think. Oh, you need a break as well. Oh, wow. Everyone needs a break. Upgrade in the colorizer. Nah, you're not anymore. Someone better will do that. Uh, no, let's borrow them. Where's the colorizer? Thank you. Oh, just 3%. We can do this. We can. We have to. You want a break. Go for a break. It's fine. You shouldn't be on reception Out of anyway. All rudderless years, Two Point County has never been in greater need of strong leadership. So vote for four more years of Tabitha Winsock in the mayoral elections. Tabitha Winsock, wrong but stable. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. For some reason, they were going on a break on call. Um, and not bothering to go and uh, service that reception desk, which was really annoying. 88%! <gasps> oh my word, come on, we can do this! Staff morale, we've got to get <laughs> get them up to 90%, come on! A new uh, target from Lord Foxbridge, uh, promoter staff member, okay. 
Um, fair enough. We don't have one that we can promote. Are we, we are training someone, I believe. We've just finished that. That's good. Uh, where are you? Someone's just finished. Our assistant. Perfect. Uh, servicing reception. Are you? Which one? Oh, we've got three now, haven't we? Of course. <gasps> Didn't think about that. Promote a staff member. We just need to wait for someone to want promotion. <laughs> like that oh we've just done a career goal achieved 50 train 50 assistants yay awesome awesome indeed what's going on in this general diagnosis got a little bit of a queue going on haven't we uh, we're gonna have to look at opening the other one and i want to get that treatment doctor training Have we got a spare anywhere that can train? No, we don't. Okay. Guess trainer it is. How are we doing for diagnosis nurses? We've got um, two on break. So we could potentially train one if we can there. Could train that one or the one at the top. Let's train Howard Syrup. We did say Howard was going to be the next one to be trained, didn't we? And we're just going to guest train it and get a couple on the go. Why not? Why not? Another target, 200 research points. Ah, we aren't actually uh, doing a research project at the moment. So let's go for advanced upgrade um, of the injection room, I think. Another staff promotion, upgrade a machine. Perfect. I'm sure we'll have one we can upgrade. Have we got any that are only at level one still. Don't think we do now. I think we're I think we're pretty good. Oh no we do. Our oh, jab master. Okay, there we go. Nice cheap upgrade. Turtle head emergency. No, I think we'll skip that. Oh 89% staff morale! Oh come on! <laughs> I want to do this without putting up the staff pay. Can we give the, can we get a new janitor? Cause I think we we might be a little bit low on maintenance janitors. How are we doing in surgery now? Cause that was quite bad for cues, but we was having a second one. We're a bit better, aren't we? Oh, that. <laughs> Who are they? Oh, they're the, they're the surgeon. Oh, oh, it's a hard life. <laughs> Is he tired? He's on a break on call. Tired, thirsty, and cured a patient. Is he? I think he's stuck. <laughs> Barney, do you need us to move you? <laughs> Go in there. Oh, oh, sugar! Oh, we, we've um, we've broken him. <laughs> He's stuck in his scrubs. <gasps> oh no! Look how tiny he is. <laughs> oh, maybe we should let him go for a break. He's so tired. <laughs> oh, poor dude. That's it. You get you get yourself a coffee, Barney. Oh, <laughs> poor Barney. Oh no, there's a queue of seven in there and I've said you can go for a break. <laughs> can we get a spare surgeon? No, 
Oh no, 88% morale, that's not good. Anyone that we can just get rid of. Um, yeah, you. Short temper. Weak bladder. Pop star visit. Um, Jasmine Odyssey. Yeah, go on. Uh, actually, what are those staff training? So they could train in maintenance three, couldn't they? From oh yes, of course. We were we were getting janitors for that. We trained that uh, teacher uh, so that they could train everyone. Oh, I sped it up. Sorry. <laughs> Let's have a look at uh, staff energy. See that Janet is actually quite tired, um, but they're just gonna have to just gonna have to go for it and train up those staff. Look at this. Training rooms look so much better with these bookcases in, I must admit. Oh no, we're at 87%. Okay, let's have a quick look at staff to make sure there's no pay reviews. Yes, there is. Maybe that will um, help our cause. Oh, promote a staff member. We can do that. Yay! we got any more staff that really really need oh actually i think we're our training rooms are quite full at the minute actually but treatment two might be done soon have we got anyone else that needs treatment two no okay worth a try What's our psychiatrist doing? I haven't seen them for a while. Oh no! <laughs> I need the loo! <laughs> Brendan <Maintenance> Wizard. <laughs> uh, oh! Oh, that nurse has got her arm through the wall. Oh, because she's playing with the wand. <laughs> oh, yay, we've upgraded the Jab Master. Oh cool, that's good. Actually, you look a bit bored. Do you, would you like a break? You can have a break. What else can we upgrade? Oh, 89% morale! Oh. <laughs> Are we ever going to reach 90%? Are we? Really? <gasps> yes! <laughs> We did it! Oh my word! Dear hospital administrator, three star hospital, three star status, felicitations, go do something else. I've been wanting to for a while, thank you very much, Mr. Tarquin Foxbridge. Oh, well, my word, staff morale, well, choice words on that one. Um, <laughs> But we did it, we did it. Perseverance, attractiveness, getting your hospital attractive uh, and what have you, and lots of other things uh, has helped. And we've now got a bonus of $50,000, 200 kudosh. Uh, and we can uh, open up the map and go uh, to the next hospital, which I have a feeling is Grockle Bay, which is a pretty horrible one. Um, but we've finished Duckworth upon Build on our hundredth episode! Yes! <laughs> oh, I love it! That's brilliant! Um, yeah, staff morale. Uh, keeping the pay up, making sure the staff are uh, going for their breaks, uh, making sure that they're, you know, you're keeping on top of training, promotions. Uh, speaking of which, we'll let them get promoted now. Um, seems to have a big uh, impact on things like that uh, so we've done it we've got it up to 90 percent now uh, and we have completed duckworth upon bilge uh, and i'm not going to continue in this hospital any longer so moving forward um if you're a regular 
viewer of the series, uh, we're going to go on to uh, numbering the hospital episodes just for each hospital um, and get away from this big uh, 100th <laughs> episode numberage that's going on right now. Um, so that's just something to look out for moving forward. I'm going to, I've been waiting to finish this hospital before I come recorded the next uh, remix challenge because I wasn't sure if it caused an issue um, uh, recording those whilst I was in the middle of a hospital uh, because I did seem to come back to lots of um, health issues and what have you. Uh, but whether the hospital continues as you go along, I'm not really sure. Um, but never mind, we'll figure that out at some point. But I really hope you've enjoyed uh, Duckworth upon Build and enjoyed my frustrations at this hospital because this is a horrible one. It's looking a bit better. We've got queues down quite well, so you know, health's getting a bit better obviously because the queues are better now. Uh, we seem to hit a bit of a block where we weren't getting enough public targets that we could complete which put us into debt, which meant we couldn't build the rooms, couldn't get the staff, couldn't train the staff, couldn't upgrade the items. So it's just a knock on effect uh, in this hospital uh, with things like that, uh, that can just put a huge spanner in the works. Uh, so, but we've managed to survive it uh, and we are moving on. But yes, I really hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe. And I really hope to see you again soon.